Hello, today we will demonstrate a paper chromatography experiment. Take chromatography paper and cut three strips of the same size slightly longer than your bicker. We got three identical stripes. Take a large beaker and carefully pour about one cm of ethanol into it. Place one of the stripes against the beaker and use a pencil to mark a point on the stripe so that it is above the ethanol level. Draw a line along this point with a pencil on the stripe. Draw a cross in the middle of each line. Using a marker, draw a small dot on the cross. To keep the strip straight, we built a structure and attached them to a ruler using paper clips. Carefully dip the bottom of the strip into the beaker. Make sure the dot you drew does not touch the solvent. Also, make sure that the chromatography paper doesn't touch the bottom of the beaker. Watch as the water begins to climb up the filter paper, carrying the pigments from the marker with it. Wait for about 20 minutes. As you can see, at some point, the ethanol continued to rise, but the pigment had already stopped. Then, take out the chromatography paper and place it on the table. Using a ruler, measure the distance from the original drawn line to places where the pigment runs out. This will be distance traveled by the component. Next, measure the distance from the drawn line to the line at the end of the ethanol. Now we need to calculate the RF value using the formula below. This was our paper chromatography experiment. 